All right guys, what's up? So I waited for almost eight months and yesterday I got a message from a really good shop, Alternate. I bought all my uh, computer stuff there. Uh, the only thing was that the R RTX 3080 was not available anymore. They sent me yesterday that message. I called them yesterday after eight months waiting on that card. I called them yesterday and they came with a really good solution. And that solution is in this box right now. I'm gonna open it, I'm gonna enjoy the moment. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Ooh. All right, guys. <laughs> After eight months waiting, this is the RTX 3070. I'm very, very happy. I'm very stoked to install it into my PC and to test it. So let's do that. All right, so I installed my graphic cards into my uh, PC and now we are gonna go and download the driver. So you go to the website from NVIDIA and you're gonna download the right NVIDIA driver. All right, so you need to select your product type. For me, that's GeForce and your product series. So it's GeForce RTX 30 series. My product was not the uh, 3070 Ti, but it was the G4 RTX 3070. Operating system is Windows 10 64 bit. Then we go to download type, and that is for me, it was the studio driver because I use DaVinci Resolve, my language is English, and then you're gonna search and you're gonna download the driver. Important is that you will install it and he will ask you how to install it and please install a clean driver so he will delete the old driver and install the new driver just clean so guys i went to davinci resolve and i filmed a wedding on the sony a7s3 and you know all that it is a really good camera but it also has a big file all right so i uh, shot on 4k 50 frames per second, right up here you see that. And it's big fall because it's 10 bit. And with my old video card, I couldn't even play this video. I needed to make proxies and the whole thing and everything was lacking. So I'm really curious about how it will uh, perform right now. So let's take this clip, let's double click on it. Let's hope for the best. <laughs> All right, guys, so that was pretty smooth. Um, uh, let me see how things are performing when I put it on the timeline. I guess it's also doing a pretty good job. It's not lagging, it plays like butter. And yeah, I really like this. Let me see if I take just a few clips. And these are some really, really big files, okay? So let's put them in right up here. And let's go to delivery. Let's take uh, MP4. And let's take my, my uh, graphic cards, of course. And the rest is just perfect. All right, here we go. Render it all. Let's see how it performs. So you see that it will use like <laughs> a lot of the graphic cards when you are exporting and that is great. Guys, it does a really, really good job exporting. 
I can say that to you right now, it does a great job, all right? It also goes really, really fast. And um, yes, I'm really happy. I will keep you updated how I think this card is performing. So my build is now complete. I am very happy. And yeah, guys, if you are thinking about buying a card, uh, I couldn't get the 3080 anymore, but the 3070, it's just fine. And I think for video editing, it is just a really great card. All right, guys, have a really nice day and I will check you out in my next video.